Hi everyone, YouTube land. Again, it's Randy and I'm back. You're looking at this guy going, not a real Build-A-Bear, but then again, they haven't done a Daredevil bear either. So I thought, how about be different, right? So built, did you guys all know that like Daredevil used to, is actually a Avenger in Reserve? So I have this really cool, you know, Daredevil hoodie. And so, yeah, this is just an Avenger in Reserve Spider-Man. That's what we're calling him. This is a costume they made during the time that they had made the previous Spider-Man bears, the one with the spiders all over him. Spider webs, he's the red bear. And you put this costume on him, which is adorable. It's one of three different costumes I know they've made of Spider-Man. I'm sure there's probably been more because they've done Spider-Man over and over. But it's one of the cutest costumes I've seen. Back when they did the uh, the Avengers set with the Iron Man and Captain America, they didn't have a Spider-Man bear at the time. So they did this. And you could put this on any one of the bears that they had there. So I had to have this costume. I just happened to have a bear at home that actually fit it pretty decently. It's a little big on him. But then again, he's just a little spider bear. Which brings me to my main point. When you buy from Build a Bear, they always like to have like little mini little one-time pieces, like little minis to go with the set. And he's kind of my little mini bear right here. So he brought along some friends to show you what you could get in the Avengers set. Some of these are still sold in the store. Some are kind of hard to find anymore. You probably have to find them online or some of the Discovery stores or like the one up in Farmington because they always seem to have things that the other stores don't have. I don't know why. And so here they are. One. So this is the Falcon. And isn't he adorable? And again, just like all the other Builder Bears, he has his emblems on his feet. Aren't they cool? I love the little wing pattern they put here. Like, they put a little detail on it. He's got his little wings and his little crown. So, again, it looks like the second set of the Builder Bears, where it's a bear dressed in a costume, which is just adorable. And so, instead of doing a full size one, they did, again, these minis. But Spider Man, though, everyone loves him so much, they actually did a Spider Man mini, who actually is a replica of the Spider Man we showed you a few days ago. And again, just like before, you get to see the little emblem on their feet. Isn't that cool? And he looks just like the big one. I love how he got this little hand, like, like he's getting ready to shoot web. I wish they would have done that with uh, the big Spider-Man bear, but that's still cool on the mini. Then we have Black Widow here. And I think a lot of them they probably did because they were secondaries. Probably they didn't think they'd be as popular as the other ones, but they wanted to give the opportunity to get the full set. And when you think about like Hulk Bear, Iron Bear, they're kind of bigger because, you know, they're bigger names, bigger heavy haters. Well, these guys are just little guys, so I don't know. That's why they were thinking. But you got her little utility, her little belt here, her little um, hair here. I don't mind the hair so much on her as a mini. It's actually kind of cute. They did do one later on. They did the Gamora one, which we showed you before, where the wig looked kind of funny on the bear. This one looks okay on her. But, like, when they found the green bear is the reason why I got Gamora, because it actually fit better than hair. Because the hairs do tend to look weird. The wigs they do for the princesses looks... If you don't comb them like a regular hair, they look stringy. And I think... And they got this other little mini. He's like really tiny. You've probably seen him before. We probably showed you a piece of him when he was uh, with the Guardians. But this is little Drax the Destroyer. He has little designs right there, right? Of course, he's so tiny they didn't put any emblem on his feet other than the Build-A-Bear one, which is kind of cool. So, like I said, some of these you can still find in stores. There is one that I'm missing... I would love to add to my collection and complete it, and that would be um, uh, Star Lord the Little Mini, because I already had Star Lord costume. But they did actually make a mini of Star Lord, which is the one I'm missing from my set. So maybe one of these days I'll get him and add it and show you guys. But at any rate, so this is showing what you can get at Build a Bear. If you um, and these usually are pretty reasonably priced, I guess, if you like uh, the little minis, because you know the the Beanie Babies tend to be uh, comparable pricing. So like these are about eight bucks, seven to eight bucks, depending on what they are. And they do go up in value like really quickly once they're sold out. So just so you know. But again, that's what you can get at Build-A-Bear. And we'll show it to come back tomorrow and show you another full-size Build-A-Bear. So be ready for that. See you guys.